Hi guys, this is Johnny Bean. Welcome back to Monster Legends. Now, in this episode of Monster Legends, I am going to bring you the magic monster. I thought I'd bring you this monster, but looking back through all the videos, I've noticed I've not. So, the reason that I'm doing a sort of older analysis of this monster is because he's in the 72, 72 hour challenge. Now, I will bring a video on that later on today. I was hoping that the website would update. It's not updated yet. But if it's not, I will just jump onto the phone and we can talk through it there. So there's no problems in that. But as I said, there's an epic monster, there's this monster, and there's Super Tomato. So some of you guys might be saying, well, what monster do I go for? And after this analysis, I might be able to give you a general idea. But I will, again, probably go over my findings on the 72-hour challenge video anyway. So here we go. <laughs> Again, I always base these monsters on the monsters I use. In this particular case, I'm using the White Panda Elf, just to just double check stats here. So I think that power is quite low anyway, but we'll double check. Okay, so here we go then. Power is 3069, Panda Elf is 3311, so it is low on power as I thought. Life is 2800 or over, Panda Elf is 2900. Plan of better than again. Speed 3454, four, looks about the same. 3432, three, right, so it's faster anyway. It's a little bit faster than Pandelf. And the stamina is the stamina. Right, and we can also get this monster in the 72 hour challenge. Is that? No, it's updated. Right, so it's immune to instant death. I've always hated that trait because not hardly 1% like or maybe of the monsters have that. So that kind of sucks. Unless. Within the skills, it might say something a lot like, no, um, immune to instant death or instant, no, I mean, you know what I mean. I might say, we'll kill everybody with Reaper, Reaper effect or something, but we'll get into that anyway. Right, so the gold is 155, that is kind of shit, but nonetheless, let's see what the skills are. So, special move? That's a multiple enemy with 70 attack, alright. Deals massive magic damage to all enemies. Removes all positive status effect from all targets. The massive magic bit's good, but the, the other bit's pish. Okay, skill group one. Deals moderate special damage. 35 attack, zero cooldown. Eh. What else have we got? Deals moderate magic damage, 35 attack. Again, zero cooldown, and then we've got deals moderate special damage, which is fucking slightly the same for that's a 40 attack that one, so you'd be as well getting that one if you are any of these three. But for me, I'm going to leave them on the table. This one, deals moderate special damage, removes all positive status effects from target. A 45 attack, two cooldown. Hmm... Here's one. Multiple enemy. Removes 50% of stamina from all targets. I'm liking that so far. Apply stamina leak to all targets. Right, so not only is it removing 50%, but it's going to cause a stamina leak as well. Again, which will be good for Timmy, because it's magic as well. Remove 50% of your stamina and give him a little leak. Perfect. Again, it'd be good for Volt. If you can't stun him or whatever. Um, next. Deals moderate special damage, gains haste. Right, so this basically makes our monster a little bit quicker. So that's a 45 attack with a zero cooldown. Oh, so you keep doing that then. Alright, okay, so again, the skills we're seeing here, they're not... They're okay, but they're not great. So judging by what I've seen so far, Super Tomato all the way. But let's just see what... There could be something hiding in the group 3, but I doubt it, but it could be. Right, deals moderate special damage requires cooldown. 45 attacks, 2 cooldown. No. This one. After 4 turns, all enemies will die. Right, okay. Right, so you'll use that. Phone, I'm doing a video here. So you'll use that, and after 4 turns, the enemies will die. Now that's going to be quite shit for a war, because sometimes it doesn't last that long. 
It could be alright if you're using it against as an Oros or you know like the big man mountain that's people stack lots of health on him. It could be alright for that. But four turns could be a long time. Uh what else have I got? Deals moderate special damage, may slow target, forty five attack, zero kill down. Yeah. So as I suspect this suspect this? As I suspected, this monster is a pile of shit. He's not the strongest, he's not got the greatest health, he does he is slightly, slightly fucking midgy boy here faster. But you go first to do what? So yeah, that's this monster. Don't go anywhere near him. If you've started, if you're watching this video and you've started collecting him, stop! Stop! Whoa! Oh, oh, whoa! Move on to the Super Tomato because he is a lot better. Uh, I've done an analysis on, analysis on him, which I'll probably put at the end of this video, unless I put it at one of these corners somewhere. But he is a lot better monster than him. Uh, at least he's got possession, I think. So, yeah. So that's what to do. We'll get the Super Tomato Boy. Alright. <laughs> okay, guys. Thank you very much for watching this video. If you liked it, click on that like button, and I'll see you again. Bye, guys. Thank you.